Property Simple here for another Tip Tuesday. Last week we talked about how to use Twitter as a realtor and today we'll be diving into the world of LinkedIn. LinkedIn is very different from the other social networks we've talked about this far, mostly when it comes to the platform's audience. LinkedIn is specifically a place for professionals who want to connect, network, and show off their skills and accomplishments. Your LinkedIn profile contains a ton of information about you and is just as important, if not more, than what you're actually posting. And so we've split up our LinkedIn guide into two separate tips, and today we'll just be focusing on optimizing your profile. This guide is basically just going to be one big action item, but don't worry because we're going to walk you through each and every step. So let's get started. When optimizing your LinkedIn profile, step one is choosing the right photos. Upload a professional yet friendly and inviting photo and try to use the same photo as your other social channels to keep with consistency and build brand recognition. You'll also want to upload a cover photo or that bigger photo behind your profile photo. Here you can get a little bit more creative showcasing more of your personality or your business. Maybe upload a recognizable photo of the area that you sell in or a banner proudly displaying an award that you've won. Step two to optimizing your LinkedIn profile is writing a killer headline. Your headline are those two to three lines under your name, and this area is prime branding real estate. These two to three lines will follow you around like a bad habit. Every time you post, friend someone, or do anything on LinkedIn, those two to three lines will show up under your name. But how do you write a killer headline and stand out from the crowd? For starters, don't just fall back on something generic like Realtor at Keller Williams. Instead, craft a headline that makes potential clients and even other real estate professionals eager to connect with you. If you tuned into my tip on personal branding and authenticity, this is where your brand headline can come in. Be professional yet personable. Try to include three to four searchable keywords and most of all, be specific. Let's look at Property Simple's founder and CEO, Adrian Fisher. Adrian could have left his headline as the LinkedIn default, CEO at PropertySimple.com, but honestly, that would be pretty boring. A headline like that doesn't tell us anything about Adrian, who he is, or even what he really does. Instead, Adrian spruced it up a bit. His headline reads, Tech Enthusiast and Entrepreneur, Revolutionizing Real Estate, Founder and CEO at PropertySimple.com. This headline tells us what Adrian does, what he's passionate about, and even what his goals are. Now that you're all set up with professional photos and a killer concise headline, let's get down to the details of your profile. Step number three is optimizing your summary. When it comes to your background and your summary, this is where you want your profile viewers to really get to know you and your professional experience. So break down the details a little bit more here. How long have you been working in real estate? Why should prospective clients work with you? What do you do for your clients that makes you the right choice to sell their home? Next, you'll want to add any skills, accomplishments, awards, or certificates. Anything that establishes your expertise and boosts your credibility as a realtor. You'll also want to create a custom LinkedIn URL with your name to make sure your profile is easily searchable and SEO friendly. Lastly, update your contact information to contain your current email, phone number, and link your other social channels so that people know how to get in contact with you outside of LinkedIn. Follow these simple steps to optimize your LinkedIn profile and then get ready for next week where we'll be talking about what you can post on LinkedIn to generate real estate leads.